Hello everyone, this is Crota giving you part one of a two-part replay between Todd and Wolf here on Echo Isle. Yes, it is good to be back. And this should be a you know a pretty normal game coming in from Wolf and Todd. And I think I'm gonna be a little bit rusty on my shot casting, so uh, please don't judge me too critically. I'm just trying to get back into the swing of things here. Here we have Todd going ahead and building the standard altar of kings and barracks. Pretty standard build. The next peasant should go ahead and pop out, build a farm. And yes, we do have an early scout coming in from Todd. So not quite sure what Todd is going for here. Oh, Todd is going to go ahead and use that militia to try to bring in some additional creeps to try to take down that Ancient of War. So is he going to be able to do it? Not quite sure. Yes, he is able to do it. So the Ancient of War is now going to go ahead and get and focused down by those creeps. Really, really nice play coming in from coming in from Todd here. And that Ancient of War is going to be cancelled. We do have a sec an Altar of Elders being built, but Wolf is going to be a really far behind at this point. And if he's not really careful, and we do, he did lose a Wisp right now. And Wolf, Ancient of War, currently seeing 170 hit points, may go down. And Todd is going to go ahead and build a scout farm right next to an, a moon wall as well. So an early action coming from Todd. And let's see what's going to happen to this Ancient of War. Ancient of War, yes, is going to get cancelled. And now the, or the Warden is going to go ahead and get um, trained instead of a Demon Hunter. No, that was not a switch. Uh, it looked, um, Wolf wanted to get the Warden ever since the beginning. So... No Ancient of War, no Ancient of War creeping for Wolf. Let's see if, if Wolf is going to go ahead and change up his strategy. Wolf does not have an, an, an Ancient of War being built anywhere right now. And I don't think he cancelled that Ancient of War. By the looks of how much wood he has, um, he didn't... Uh, let's see, actually, take a look. Yeah, he may have cancelled it. I'm not quite sure. Wasn't able to keep track of the gold at that time. We have a second scout farm coming in from Todd. Building another scout farm to the south, making sure if the warden does come south... He is able to go ahead and spot that Warden. Not quite sure what he, the Warden is going to do. Now, Warden wants to do some harassing, it looks like. So the Warden is going to go ahead and do some harassing against Todd. Todd is going to go ahead and do some creeping with his footmen and militia. Get about halfway to level 1. Warden is halfway there. So War Warden is now trying to take down that Wisp. That Wisp is probably going to detonate. Uh, let's see if we get... Do we are going to... No, yeah, we do get a detonation. We have a Shadow Strike on Archmage. Archmage picks up a Ring of Protection. And the Warden is now trying to do some damage on the um, Archmage. Archmage is able to run to the back of the base. We have another Hunter's Hall being built, so Wolf changing up the strategy and going Huntresses instead of Archers early on and not doing some creeping. Mm, I want to see how this uh, Warden works with Huntresses as opposed to the typical Priestesses of the Moon. No secondary farm being built to completely wall off the base, so let's see what happens to the Warden. Warden is now trying to come in, trying to focus down the Archmage. The Archmage is... Let's see, the Archmage is now trying to run from the Warden. Warden wants to do that kill steal with the Shadow Strike. And let's see if he's going to be able to get it off. He's currently sitting at 79 hit points. Now trying to focus down the Warden. Well, and yes, we do have an um, Archmage getting in that last kill. So the, um, or the Footman able to get in that last kill. We have a ton of strength being picked up by the Warden though. So, And the Archmage is now currently sitting at level 2. If Yes, no, actually no, almost at level 2. Currently sitting at level 1, only 8 experience away. Now trying to, that Wisp is now trying to run around, do some additional damage, maybe do some detonations to prevent another Water Elemental. Uh, we do have an Ancient of War being completed and a second Ancient of War completed, or nearing completion as well. So we are going to have two, um, a double hunt, or dual Ancient of War Huntresses coming in from Wolf. Trying to look for the Archmage now, right? Arch Archmage now trying to do some creeping towards this mercenary camp. Doing a really good job of creeping, even though the the Warden is harassing right now. We do have five militia coming in, so we have an expansion attempt and more Wisp coming in. A drop of another Water Elemental, and we are going to go ahead and try to take down that Troll Trapper. That Troll Trapper running around the map for no real reason except for to try to ensnare a single militia. We do have an ensnare... Uh, we do have a... No, we did not get the kill, I don't think. He did not get the kill off of that Shadow Strike. So very nice play. Now the Ogre Magi now surrounded. Warden does not have enough mana to do another Shadow Strike. So no... F oh, d I think he did get that last kill off. So and yes, it is only... I, I thought it was 75 mana for a Shadow Strike. I was mistaken. It's only 65 mana for a Shadow Strike. And the Warden was able to get that last kill off. And now uh, two or three quarters of the way to level 2. Huntress is now trying to uh, finally join in on the fight. We have Wisp now coming in as well. We have a Moonwell uh, sitting next to the tavern, so we may have a, um, excuse me, ooh, nice dust of appearance. A staff of teleportation to get Todd out of there in a, in a hurry, as a Huntress was going to try to trap him back there. We do have some towers nearing completion, more towers being built, 
Um, to Todd's still currently sitting at tier one at this point. And Archmage now going to go ahead and do some more creeping here, trying to take down this um, creep camp. Perhaps Todd will get lucky and get a Tome of Experience here. And now he's going to go ahead and take down these units here. Taking down those units now. We have Nightcrawler currently poisoning units. And the Archmage should get up to level two. If and Let's see what's going to happen here. Warden, meanwhile, is now going to go... Going to creep the Ogre Magi over here on this side. It does currently stand at level 2, does have a boost of speed, so it is going to be able to chase down that Archmage all around the map. Uh, it picks up a circle of nobility for her efforts, and Archmage is currently sitting at level 2 as well. I think they're going to go ahead and meet at the at the shop. Yeah, the, the two armies are going to meet at the shop, and let's see what's going to happen here. So both armies, no, and Arch uh, Todd does not want to engage the armies just quite yet. Uh, and Militia is now doing some additional scouting, trying to make sure what's going on. Still currently sitting at Tree of Life. So both players sticking to t um, Tier 1 a little bit longer than normal. Um, Wolf is in is not in position. Does not look like Wolf wants to do a fast expansion attempt. And we do have a Tree of Life at being uh, hidden away. So we, I take that back. We do have a fast uh, an expansion attempt after he takes down this mercenary camp. And we have a Todd finishing up speed building his... A town hall, and it is already well protected. Two guard towers in play, and not getting the masonry upgrade at this time. Footman currently sitting in the middle of the base. F Arch, uh, let's see, farm being b farm, probably scouting out this tree of life. Not sure the quite the range on that at night time for a farm. A tree of life. Let's see what's going to happen here. Uh, uh, Huntress is now trying to take down that single farm, and Huntress is now trying to not quite sure what they want to do. Um, Archmage is currently sitting at level 3, uh, quickly sells his Dust of Appearance, um, and so, um, only keeps a Staff of Teleportation and Boots of Speed. It gonna, is going to take down that Ogre Mauler, and Archmage is already currently sitting at level 3. We have three Guard Towers up, a Town Hall... Town Hall producing additional units, and we are now finally taking the Keep for Todd. So, Todd currently taking the Keep, Wolf taking the Tree of Ages. Huntress is now trying to come in and join in on the fight. We have a Wisp that it does go down to the Focus Fire of an Archmage. And we have the Warden now coming in as well. The Warden gets a quick Shadow Strike on a low hit point Footman. That Footman is going to drop. And Todd designed the experience on that Footman. And Warden now continuing the chase. A Shadow Strike, another Footman. And that one Footman is going to go down to and perhaps give some additional experience as well. Let's see. Down to 46 hit points, 21, and down goes the Footman. So... Nice play from both players. Archmage now coming in does have a does have sentry ward, so may drop a sentry ward to try to see figure out what the whole entire strategy is. Now gonna go after us and do some wisp harassment. So wisp wisp are very very um, non plentiful at this point coming in from Wolf. So Wolf does have a staff of teleportation and, and Art Water Elemental now trying to do some extra damage, trying to do some harassment. Warden now trying to ch chase down a Archmage. Archmage able to teleport away, teleporting back to the south side. And we have Moonwells in play. Let's see what's going to happen with these Huntresses. And Archmage does need to drop a lot of Water Elementals to try to counter those hunts. Otherwise, it, it really is of no effort. And those footmen are not a good counter to those Huntresses. We have a Moonwell being focused down by Todd in the middle of the middle of the map right now. S meanwhile, we have a Water Elemental trying to focus down a Moonwell as well. That Moonwell may go down. Not quite sure. Um, it does do, and the Water Elemental is doing piercing damage, but the timing um, may be a little bit off. Let's see. The Water Elemental looks like it is going to go ahead and take down that last that constructing Moonwell, and we have another. Uh, have the Warden now trying to chase down those Footmen as well. And getting another Shadow Strike off. Archmage does a quick use of a Clarity Potion to try to go ahead and save himself. Is he going to deny that? Ooh, yeah. Oh, does not able to deny that Shadow Strike. So the Warden does get some additional experience right now. Huntress is currently in play. And did not do... Did not... Um, creep out the mercenary camp as I expected with the Tree of Life. The Tree of Life wants to entangle this gold mine and get this expansion up and running as quickly as possible. Both players currently uh, still sitting in low upkeep. And there's my timer. Go ahead and stay tuned for part two of this replay between Todd and Wolf here on Echo Isle.